Hi, I'm Monica and welcome to my book channel. I wanted to make a little quick video about why you should be grateful about romanticy and if you don't know what that is, it's romance in a fantasy world. I don't want to go too much into detail so this is going to be a very quick video and I'm just going to start listing off my reasons why you should be grateful for a genre like romanticy. Number one, some of us want to read about a romance that is happening in a fantasy world because real life can suck sometimes. <laughs> really like take me away to a land that is about a human who falls for a fae or a vampire or another fantastical creature and maybe also just keep it plain and simple just have humans with magical abilities but that just makes a romance book a lot more fun to read about. It represents a real true escape from reality and that is one of the reasons why I read. Number two, more people are reading. Even if you're not a huge fan of this new genre that's gaining in popularity, you can't deny the fact that a lot more people are reading. Although this might be somewhat anecdotal and we see people say they're reading more on social media and I don't know the numbers and all of that, but I would say that is a good thing and there really is something out there in the bookish world for everyone to enjoy. Number three, the new adult genre failed us all and this is where romanticy comes to save us all. <laughs> romanticy is coming into more popularity through book talk and honestly all forms of social media. I'm excited for romanticy to become a more popular genre because I was part of those group of readers that had Twilight coming out, The Hunger Games, Divergent, and a lot of the popular young adult books. But like now we're all grown up. <laughs> if you were part of that era and maybe we want something a little bit more with young adult writing but with more mature themes. I'm quite sure a lot of people enjoy that type of mixture although I am personally growing out of that YA phase. I still enjoy the romanticy books I have read. So the romanticy genre comes in and saves the day because we have the YA writing, you also have the more mature themes in the romance category as well as other hard-hitting topics. But I think overall, it really just brings everything that was kind of missing for us. Number four, at the end of the day, reading is for fun. And for me, it is one of my personal favorite hobbies to do. And I do want to say thank you to Romanticy for becoming more popular and really launching people onto their own reading journeys. It's really fun to see that even with people in my life that don't really read, now they're really into reading. So Thank you to Romanticy for achieving that goal that I have ceaselessly tried to do on my own. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Um, this video isn't meant to be really serious. I just wanted to have like a new flavor of a video on my channel. And let me know what you think about this, if I should continue doing this sort of format, and just kind of like spewing out my thoughts at you. With all that being said, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up, hit that subscribe button if you want to, and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye!